guys, welcome back to our channel. If you're new to this channel, we're glad to have you here. And to all our subscribers, thank you guys so much for coming back. And thank you for joining me. And for today's video, we'll be using this round cylinder pedestal from ubackdrop.com. It comes in three bags. All right, different sizes. This one is 40 by 90 centimeter. This one is 36 by 75 centimeter and 33.60 centimeter. All right, so we'll open one and I'll show you how to assemble them. It's so easy. It comes in this sturdy, nice bag. It's nice and light and sturdy. So let's open this up first. We got this ready and we have extra for the, the feet right here, okay? So by the way, if you want to visit and get this product from ubackdrop.com, visit www.ubackdrop.com and please use our code FAMBAP10 to get a 10% discount. All right, so now we're ready to mount this. So we'll use the number one first and then match it to your top plate. Number one goes to one. Just screw it on here. All right, so we're done with number one. We'll put this on the side. Now we'll work on the bottom part, which is number four. Do the same thing, just like what you did at number one. All right, so now, We'll attach number three, so just match it, three and three, and then you have this here to lock it in place, snap that in. And then what you're gonna do is put this on top. There it is. It's so easy to mount, guys. All right, it's finally done. So you do, you assemble all of them like this. It's so nice and sturdy, and it's light, see? The material here is PVC plastic and aluminum alloy tube. And the cover it comes separate, and we have it here. You can actually order a different color. You can customize so to put some print in there. And I like the material. It's kind of stretchy, and it's shiny. Almost looks like a leather material. Look at that. So it comes in a thing here you can adjust. So it's easy to put this on. So once you get this on the bottom, you can just go like this and make it tighter. And there you go guys, it's nice and smooth. And it makes it easier to, to clean because of the material, okay? So there's two ways on how you um, put this on. You can make it like that nice and smooth, or you can make this swirl. So let me turn this around. Ain't that beautiful? Sweet. It gives it more character. And just like that, and when you're done, you can put them in the bag. It's easy to carry around, nice and sturdy. So now I'm gonna assemble the other two. of them look at that in the beautiful so as I said you can make it like this or you can even like make it nice and uh, plain but I like this look and make it more beautiful in the bottom part so we'll put this on the side for now we'll decorate our round arch with balloons all right and now let's display our balloons so all the materials that we use here will be in the description down below please check that out so with the white, pink, and gold, it'll be 10 inches balloons. And for this, this is 12 inches. So now, we'll inflate our white. Since this is gonna be organic, it's not gonna be the same size when you inflate them. So, different sizes. The trick is you wanna make sure that this is nice and round. Okay, you pair this up, you put the nassel together, and then intertwine and then tie 
make another duplet. You put this across, and once you get this, you intertwine. So this is now your quad. So you want to grab the end of your balloon, one of the end, and one of the end on the other quad. You tie them together, and now it becomes a cluster of balloon. So we have our cluster balloon. So I'll do all my cluster like this. So I inflate the other color. This is 12 inches. Since I don't have a lot of this color, so we'll just make it into a quad. And then we'll put this, you know, we'll scatter this on our garland. Alright guys, so all the clusters are here. So let's start with the gold. So this time I'm going to start from the top going down. So I'll attach this here. Put it in between your round arch. And then what I'm going to do is intertwine this so it lock in place so it stays on your arch. Just like that. So it stays on the arch and then I'm gonna put another color so this time I'm gonna grab one of the balloon end and one of the end here right there and then tie this together so that you can always move it around different direction, whichever way you like it. So I'll put this here. Alright, so I'll add more on the bottom to make it more fuller. So the same thing, you grab one of the balloon end and attach it. So I have three 16 inches balloon and I tie it with our rubber band. So this is how you add your bigger balloons to your clusters or to your garland. Put it there. Then just add it. Then we'll add gold in here. All right. So this time we'll add our filler. So this is actually five inches inflated to any sizes, as long as it's kind of the same, right? Since this is organic, it doesn't have to be the same size. So after you make it into a quad, you want to use your rubber band. Just wrap this here. This is how you do your filler. So now, the reason we have this filler is to fill up the gap that you see here. You can use more filler or less filler. It's your preference. All right, so this is now done. So now we'll add more decorations here. We'll be using our pool noodle. So we'll put this here. So about this much, so halfway. So we'll cut this half. Once you got this half, you slice this on the side. So you get this open, okay? We'll put this. Okay. 
Okay, so once you get this on, I will use zip tie. We'll cut the extra and then we will attach our flower. So again, we'll put this in the description down below where to get it. You can always check our Amazon storefront. Please check it out. So we'll add some greenery here. All right, this is finally done, and now the, for the final touch, we will add our cellular pedestal from ubackdrop.com. There you go. We'll put this here. There you go. It makes it more beautiful with the stand right there. You can put your dessert or cake in the nice guys. So again, from ubackdrop.com, visit www.ubackdrop.com and use our code FEVEN10 to get a 10% discount. Beautiful. All right. I hope you guys learned something from this video today. If you do like this, please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet. Once again, this is FEMEN NY. We'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye.